What you looking at, buddy? I'm, I'm trying to find a heavier slow pitch jig. You want heavier slow pitch jigs? Yeah, we only have the 200. The I have this like is a 210. I'm trying to find. Yeah, that's high speed. Oh. Vertical jig, high speed. Same thing. It, is it though? No, it's not. I don't think it is, guys. Here's what we're doing. We are here at Atlantic Gate oh, Tackle. The closest we've Actually, to there's some stuff over here that I oh, think yeah. you guys. Here's what we're gonna do. We are gonna start beach fishing, and um, Lorenzo's Lorenzo hooked up to some tuna on the Yankee Cap, um, and that was an amazing thing for him to see him hooking up with some tuna on artificial. He's enamored with with the jigging thing, but well, I don't know about no, that. you're not. I don't know about that. I, I, we just need heavier ones. Just, we need just heavier in case. Just in case. All right, so guys, but here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna start beach fishing. And right now we are at Atlantic Bait and Tackle in Pompano Beach. And we are going to, here's the goal. We're not big artificial fishermen, but, but we want to get into some of this action, finding, catching some of these big Crevel Jacks on big poppers. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over the selection that they have here. Um, and there's not a huge selection, but I think there's enough to get us into some trouble. Guys, we're going to look at some lure selection and let's find us some lures and we're going to go try them out in future episodes and we'll show you how they do. Let's check it out. Okay. What do you got? They, these are like the pompano jigs. Pompano jigs? Yeah. Like, I don't know why. They work so well. Really? Yeah. They work so well. Well, the problem is, are there any pompano in the city of pompano? Not That's really. That's the problem. Not really. That's the problem. Too populated. Yeah. That's a lot of people. So... Well, Lorenzo, mm. I want you to talk to me. Tell me about what are we seeing here? Do you see anything up here that looks intriguing to you? This one looks kind of decent right here. Okay, that's a big popper. Yeah, I mean, it's a big popper, right? We're going for big jacks. We're I mean. going for big jacks, yeah. I mean, so guys, these big jacks. Now, isn't this something similar that you were hooking up with on the uh, to the tuna? Yeah. It was something pretty close to that, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but this would work better Chug with bug. this tuna, anyways. Oh, would it? Yeah. You want something with a bigger, a bigger pop? Yeah. All right, so guys, here we have up here these lures that are poppers, and they're made for casting long distances. That they, they cast well on your tsunami. Oh my goodness. Yeah. yeah. So a lure like this casts quite a distance on his tsunami. He's using twenty pound test, um, but we want to try and see what we can find on these guys so lorenzo what do you what are your what are your thoughts on this one right here Ow. i mean does it really make a difference does <laughs> the color does the color really make a difference with because, jacks i don't yeah. know i think jack is more of like a reaction bite jack is more a reaction bite yeah. um so this guy's 15 bucks i mean how much is that one this one is 13 bucks 13 13.99 so that's more like 14, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, so why don't you do this? We've got a couple of these big boys. Comment down below which one of these you think would work better for big jacks on the beach. Lorenzo, do you have a pick? I'm picking this guy. You want to pick here. that guy? All right. Dad, they have, they have flukes here. They have flukes. I might have to get some of those here, you know. What for? Like, you, like, let's see. In the backyard. In the backyard, like we were plenty of flukes. We're out of flukes. We're out of flukes. Out of flukes. Yeah. Well, I don't. I'm, I have limited amounts of money to spend. It's only six dollars. Yeah, yeah, it's only six bucks. But um, guys, we're looking at these poppers, and right now we have. We could also get something like a more like a walking bait right here. Oh my gosh. Hold. All right, we have Halco Australian. It you know, Australian if, if Australia lure. would make a uh, lure, it would look something like this. Yeah, let's see. Uh, Australian. I'm not surprised. Rooster Papa. Rooster, Rooster Popper. One and three quarter ounce. You think you're going to be able to cast that pretty far? How, how many ounces is one that? One and three quarter. One and three quarter? Yeah. All right, so here's what we're going to do. This may be a little heavy for your rod, but I think you'll be able to throw it. Oh, yeah, that's, that's perfect. Okay. That's perfect. So are you going to check, pick the blue one over the green? Yeah, yeah. All right, now. I'm suggesting. We could also get something like a walking bait over here. Well, I'm thinking we're gonna get a walking bait, but I'm saying I'm thinking we should try to go something smaller. Uh, maybe one a little bit smaller as well. Right. These are all Halco poppers. 
These ones are one and yeah, get one that third. One. Get that one. Wanna get that one? If it's over, it's more of like an overcast, cloudy day. We'll throw that one. All right. And what's the science behind that? I don't know. Like this. That's just, something that you of, do. That's it. It sounds sounds about right. Yeah. All right. So we got one of these. It's another popper. Do you, do you want to get a chug bug? Chug bug. Chug bug. I don't know. I mean. Or, or see, here's the thing. I think we, we're gonna we're gonna splurge on three lures right now. All right, so we've got two poppers. So might as well get a chug bug. You want to get a chug bug? What do you think, yellow I, or I red? I think red, one with the red head. There's something about that red head thing. Yeah. Here, guys, here's what we're going to go with. We, we have, you know, this, the old Zero Spook yeah. is a lure that is very classic for catching fish. Honestly, I'm kind of looking I'm kind of looking at this silver one. Ooh. Silver Zero Spook? Wait, hold on, wait, there we go. Right here. Silver spook. I don't know what that. But like also the black one. This one is good. Super spook. Dude, look at this. Oh, oh, see through. See through. I don't know about that. I don't, know. I don't know what the science is on that. But I, I do know that the old classic zero spook with the white body and the red head is a classic snook lure. Um, there's a lot of a lot of people yeah. use these and they get top water action. Dude, those are look. Those are thin hooks though. Are they? Look at that. It's got three trebles. Oh my. There's a lot of trouble. Yeah, we might be, we we probably take the last one off. There's a lot of trouble you can get into the, with this lure. Yeah, we'll probably take <laughs> one off. A lot of, of them trouble. Off. Oh, what did you do? Yeah, we'll probably, we'll probably there's, a, there's a lot of trouble that you can get into with that lure. All right, pick, pick one of these two lines. Which one are you going to pick? Zero spook or chug bug? I think we have enough um, uh, poppers. poppers. All right, so we'll put the chug bug back. So we're going to try with these. All right, Lorenzo, are you happy with this? Yeah. So guys, here, here's what we got. We've got, we're gonna try a one, one and three quarter ounce big blue popper, Rusta Papa. We've got, that just fell. We've got this one and one third ounce, a little bit of a different color, a little bit lighter. I think Lorenzo's Tsunami Saltex will launch this just as well. Dad, look at this. We get that at Walmart for 99 cents, but like 24 of those. Yeah, but we got to support our local tackle shops. Yeah, those are, those things are amazing. All right, and show me the Zero Spook, buddy. Oh, we got it. Zero Spook is a little bit of a different presentation. Zero Spook doesn't pop, but it, it, walks. it, it walks back it walks. and forth on the top, so you get some amazing topwater bites. So, guys, we're going to go with this. And we are going to see if we can light up on the beach with these. It's springtime in South Florida. Jacks are on the beach. Renzo, are you ready to try these out? Yes, sir. Wh which one are you going to try first? I'm going to try... The big one? No, I'm going to try the middle one. Mid-size? Yeah. I'm Mid size popper. One. See if you can get lit up. Yeah. All right, man. I want to see you do it. Me you too. know what else hits them? Um, Snook. Snook Popping. will hit them, but black tip sharks too. Uh-huh, but like, well, you're going to lose it. Like, no. Yeah, well, you might. Well, these big old... What you want to hope is that one of these big old treble hooks. I mean, it only has it only face. has three. It only has three, so like. <laughs> yep. Well, yeah. This guy only has two treble hooks. Yeah, I mean, it's not as good. Not as good as the three treble hooks of a zero spoon, but. Not sponsored. Not sponsored. We are gonna try these out, guys. Hope you like the video. We are going to go pay for these now, Lorenzo. Um, we're gonna be on the beach tomorrow. So we're gonna be showing you what's up and we're gonna see show you what Lorenzo catches. You gonna wear your GoPro, buddy? I'll wear my GoPro. You wear your GoPro and we're gonna throw some lures and we're gonna see what we can hook up. Guys, like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to support your local tackle shops. Support them. Because it's a tough business. Yeah. Tough business. You know, a lot of guys are ordering online and I've got friends that have online businesses and it's good business. Mm -hmm. But support your local tax, tackle shops when you can. Um, we're gonna drop a few bucks on lures and we are gonna go and try and get tight guys till next time watch that bang